A big thanks to all of my Patreon supporters. And a big thanks to all of these donators of $5 or more. Brian D0313 Dead Zergling Radio Raptor and Vlad Tepish 3176 You all helped make these episodes possible. Howdy, insufferable gaming fans. Your old pal Rosser here with some more Castlevania Blood Moon. Last time, I got repeatedly beat up by a bunch of enemies that caused me troubles. This time, more of the same, but I am certainly going to do my best. To that end, I have a plan. Now, do you know what that plan is? It's pretty special. And I just thought of this about two seconds before I started recording. But, what if I collected a lot of hearts, or jewels in this case, right? You with me so far? And then picked up the stopwatch on the other secret platform. Do you think it could work? Well, I'm gonna try it. If it sorta works, then that'll be good, because I can keep uh, doing more of it in the future. See? There's the stopwatch, and there's a bunch of arts. So this is a pretty decent plan, I think. I'm gonna try it out. Uh, I wish that thing hadn't wound up in a bad spot on me there. But it happens. It's been known to happen. What's that again? Invincible ability. Okay. Well, that was bad. That didn't uh, work out a bit, did it? Also, now I can't seem to find the stairs. Stairs? There's the stairs. Where's the stairs? There's the stairs. So, I will keep doing this. And hopefully, that will give me the impetus I need to get through this level without ruining my life or my trachea by yelling super loud a whole bunch of times, which has been known to happen. You've, you've, heard, you've all heard me do it, but not this time. This time, I got this. Alright, that's how we handle that. Although, I did forget to go and get my stopwatch, which um, was kind of the integral part of my plan here. Eh, I was hoping there'd be a secret stairway there, but uh, I didn't see one. Alright, with you. Um... And then I, um... And then I... Um... I done fucked it up! I think, uh... I think by playing around with these... secret areas, I may have caused a glitch or two. Which is... unfortunate, to say the least. So now what am I supposed to do? Really, what can I do? I can't do jack shit. Hmm. So we we now find that my plan may be slightly flawed in the basic premise of it. Unless it works this time. It did not work this time. Hmm. Well, what the hell? Oh, you know why? Because I busted it, and then I left the screen, and when you bust something and leave the screen and come back, it's no longer breakable, like these blocks. So I need to not break that before I get my stopwatch. Okay. Th this is, um, my strategy is not dead. It has merely uh, taken a quick vacation. I can, I can make this work. I promise. Warning, promise is not representative of a guarantee. 
so really, probably shouldn't be making any at all. That's... or on my part. But you'll forgive me, right? I mean, look at all the fun we're going to have getting through this level. It'll be very satisfying when it actually happens. Very satisfying. Well, anyway, we'll start with 50 jewels, and we'll see how we do from there. I might need more. I might not. Soon. We will know the truth. Alright. Handle that. Handle this. I didn't handle it. I wish I'd have handled it. Okay. Be good again. Then the bird. Right. And then I just gotta make sure that I don't accidentally pick up anything I don't want. And we can use this stopwatch to do something about the eyes. Of which there are so, so many. Here they come now. Nope. Not gonna take a hit on that one. Alas. And then... We can get around the ghost. And these. Whoops. Any secrets up here? Nope. Okay, well at least I made it through that room. That was the major thing. And I've still got some jewels under my belt for the future. And the future is now. The future is here, man. Yeah. I wasn't falling for that again. No sorry, Bob. And go! I am shameless, and I am fine with that. Shit, I knew better! I knew better, and I did it anyway. Well, that's okay, because I've still got plenty of stopwatch to help me along on my mystical journey. It's working already, people. Ooh, and invincibility. Also good. I can do this a couple more times. This, not so much. Oh, I needed that too. Yay! I'm progressing! Look at all this invincibility! It's amazing! I'll take it. Take all I can get. Okay, that was a little rough. Twice. I could do without so many birds. So many birds. Too many birds, one might say. They're giving me lots of jewel drops, that's cool. It's like they knew. It's like they frickin' knew, man. Oh yeah. They knew what they were doing, and they're like, man, we're assholes. But then, I came up with a solution to the assholeness. It was a good solution, and it worked. We were all happy to have been a part of it. How the hell am I gonna get up here? Like that. Duh huh. Shit. What have I learned about stepping forward while whipping those things? Have I learned anything truly? Apparently not. Alright. We're making great progress here. I am eased. Could use some health. Probably we'll be wanting a new weapon by the time we reach the boss as well. How's about frickin' new? Also no. Ah, shit. Damn, I'm gonna fix. Oh well. That's, uh... 
That's how we deal with that, I guess. It's a little ugly, but, um... I'm kind of surprised I didn't die. Right there! I died right there. Mm. We came so far. Alas. It was not... to continue. But, hey. We get to keep our stopwatch, and we've only got to get a few of these largish um, crystals. Plus, if I die, I can start over with 30 of them, and that'll give me enough to last until the next part when I get there, so... All in all, I don't think this level is going to be a problem for too much longer. Though, I have been wrong in the past. For instance, that wasn't there last time. Alright, bye-bye, birdie. Tippity-toe, tippity-toe, and off we go. The blue stairs of discontent weigh heavy on our hearts. It's what they do, you know. Ah, uh, I got lucky on that one. Okay, got rid of that. Good. Not gonna deal with that. And we are good. Sweet! See? A little bit of uh, ingenuity and the game practically fixes itself. Now I just gotta make sure not to get launched into a pit by these skeleton thingies. Boneheads. Almost lost it on that one. Nope. Shit! I knew what I did wrong as soon as I did it. That's okay, it's okay, we're still good, it's still good. I know you're gonna shoot. Damn it, I wanted that candle, but I missed. It's a little harder to get than you think it is. Keep it up. Captain Ass Jack. The eyeball hype is real. There's my invincibility. Shit, 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 shit! And down the hole. I'm not good down the hole. Really? That missed too, huh? Cool. I'm gonna get that stupid candle eventually. Ah, not like that I'm not. And it begins. What begins? Oh, you know. The pain. And I kind of needed that. But I didn't need that. I, I didn't need to get hit by a bird and go sailing away. To wind up shriveled, defeated, a husk. Okay, that was a jewel. Now we know. Glad we cleared that up. Just give me my whip extension. Just give me my phone call. Right, I need to be more aggressive with that. And with that, leave us not forget. All the wonderful things! Run away! I was close. I was very, very close. I'm lucky to have not gotten hit. Hello? Um... Okay. More eyeballs? I'll bet there's more eyeballs. There's always more eyeballs. 
I preemptively done something about the eyeballs, but not about that thing. That was stupid. So was that. Really, just, uh... You know, bad judgment calls all around here, really. I wonder if... Oh, wait, I have no lives, so I guess I don't get to find out if this is a spawn point or not. I really need to get here with some lives so I can learn a little bit more. Well, it does say Area 9, whereas before we were in Area 8, so I can only assume this is a spawn point. But how would I ever know for sure? With trial and error, my friends, with trial and error. And error. And error. And error. And error. And maybe some error. Shocking, I know. But, uh, a Castlevania hack deliberately designed to be difficult would be giving me some trouble, but here we are. But then again, if you're really surprised, then you haven't been paying attention to my previous runs of my previous games and my previous hacks and my previous freakouts when everything goes tits up. Which it does a little bit more often than I would like it to, but at the same time, it makes for some compelling viewing, doesn't it? I think it's okay. The eyes... They vex me. They never piss off. They keep coming forever. I know there's gonna be a ghost. Shit. I'm making too many mistakes here. That was almost another one. Okay. I've got that part down, Pat, and now it's Area 8, and that's where things start getting tricky. And also, I missed that again. It's okay. That almost screwed me. Pretty hard. Treasure. F and I balls. F N I. Federal Nostril Inspector. Okay. Me that. And there's one here. Oh, there wasn't one there. There it was. Okay. Alright. We'll, uh, try this again then, shall we? We shall. As many times as it takes, people. That's how we do it. Saving myself a couple of, um, things there. And the invincibility will last just long enough. Whoops. I may have screwed that one up a little bit. By which I mean I definitely screwed that one up a little bit. These things happen. No sense crying about it, right? Maybe I can, uh, get that... whatever this is, this time. Or not. Not is also a possibility. Eyeball me into oblivion. I know you want to, game. Okay, I guess that's not yet. It'll be coming up, though. Six hits. Skulls take six hits. I should remember that for future edification. Shit. Every time, man. 
I wonder what's down there, but I don't wonder bad enough to risk going down there to check. Holy crap, I made it here with some extra lives this time. Maybe we'll get to see what's past the screen. That'd be nice. Right? We'd all like to see that. I'd like to see that. I mean, that's what I've been trying to do. That could have screwed me. Still might. Four, five, six. Nope. I don't think so, bird. Adios! Uh, well, at least I didn't have to start all the way back at the beginning of the effing level again. That was kind of nice. You know, small favors. Uh, see ya? Did the backstroke right on out of here. <laughs> Thanks, game. Once you start whipping while you're moving, you cannot stop. You are on roller skates for the duration of that whipping. Alright. So, if you're whipping towards something you don't want to whip yourself towards, you're gonna die. Bear that in mind, it's important. Okay. Seems like progress. But is it really? Is it really? Hey! Invincibility! I guess we're going this way. Um. Yeah. These are not quite mummies. That's okay. We're gonna do it. Do it, 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 yeah! Shit, yeah! Ah! That level was brutal. Brutal! But I skipped a goodly portion of it. I can only assume that I was supposed to, because if I had tried to go down there, I would have fallen in a pit and died. So, I feel fine with that. I really do. Now we're gonna be down in a hole. Right? Right. This is very disorienting. This is a nice looking area. I the old walking whip got me again. The old walking whip needs more cowbell. All oh, right, I still have a clock. I could use it to my advantage. I should do that. Okay, I can go down here or I can go up there. I assume there are advantages and disadvantages to each. It seems pretty advantagey so far. Hey, I can dig it. That was nearly a... Yep, that was completely a disaster. Okay, well. It's alright. It is okay, because we made some pretty good progress on that one. And I get to keep my stopwatch, which... In this game, above all others, has been useful. Like... You know, you're like... When in Castlevania has uh, the stopwatch ever been useful? Well, now you know. I'm pretty sure I don't want the boomerang. Normally I would, but uh, this ain't a normal situation. This is Blood Moon, aka Hourglass, the game. And we are going to play that game. I need to play it a little effing better. That'd be nice. Well, it's just the opening of the stage jitters, you know. This always happens at first. 
But, now I know kinda sorta where I'm going. Right? I could've used that. As usual, decided to leave me. Aha! Still don't know what that actually does, but um... Oh! That is a secret invisible pit from hell. I gotta remember that that happens. It's one of those things where, you know, you get caught on a ceiling while you're trying to jump and then bad stuff happens. I don't understand it, but I don't have to understand it, I just have to adapt to it. So I will. Keep practicing, and some great sunny day, all will be well. Right, this is the part, right? It was, but I made it that time. Do I go up? Well, I gotta go up at some point. Okay, here we are. Ooh. Somehow that's a lot scarier than the dragon ones. Because it's just a damn human skull on that thing. That's creepy as fuck, man. Stopwatch still still uh serving me quite well. And that is the equivalent of holy water, which actually, if Frankenstein's monster is coming up, I kinda wish I'd pick that up. But I don't know for sure if Frankenstein's monster is truly coming up. Hey, does this hack not have the dagger? That's awesome! Invincible! See ya! Eh, <laughs> butthole. Hey, and that gave me some health. Right, that's what that thing does. It, it gives me health. Meh. Okay. Where are we at? Where are we at? Area 12? Area... Area Flea Man. Uh, you want to whip those there, buddy? Uh, nope. Wow, that under not helpful for fighting monsters. Frankenstein monsters. Sure, it'll be palette swapped. It won't exactly be a Frankenstein monster, but it'll be something like it, I'm sure. I didn't need that. Sorry, little guy. I don't have time for your shenaniganry. You know, there are times when I hate myself for shit like that. Oh, speaking of times, um, the timer is starts out really um, low in this situation. Don't want your shit. There he is. Oh. That's, uh... Well, at least the Fleeman went straight down a pit. That's that's neat. Okay, I think this time I actually am going to want to pick up the Scythe. Reason being... I'm gonna need a distance attack for our old buddy the monster. If his friend goes down a pit again, I'd be much obliged for that. Downside is, I'm gonna have to deal with this little hopping guy down here. Which I did. So that's cool. And then. Then he goes down the hole. And I try to not go down the hole. If at all possible. I would love to not go down the hole. You know what? That did a fantastic job. That level was easier than the previous one. And I am not complaining. No siree. Really neat background, too. That one I feel was more fair, at least. But now I don't have my stopwatch again, and I might not get it back. We don't know. 
But we'll have to wait till next time to find out because I am out of time for today. But this has been quite the enjoyable, uh, enjoyable episode. It was fun figuring out how to get through level three. You know, it took it took some strategy, but we did it. And next time we'll know. So until then, this is your old pal Rosser. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much, Mr. Vlad Tepish, for sponsoring. And take a drink.